Hello, my name's Miss Skeena. Welcome to my channel. Our story of the day is The Jelly Beans and the Big Dance by Laura Numeroff and Nate Evans, illustrated by Lynn Munsinger. Please stay tuned to the end for our new subscriber shout out. Now let's get started. The Jelly Beans and the Big Dance by Laura Numeroff, Nate Evans, and illustrated by Lynn Munsinger. Emily loved to dance. She danced while waiting for the school bus. She danced while watching TV. She even danced while brushing her teeth. Emily skipped all the way to her first dance class. She walked into the studio and looked around. She saw one girl reading a book, one playing with a soccer ball, and one drawing in a sketchbook. Welcome, the teacher said. I'm Miss Tinkly Weezer. Please put your things in the cubbies. Emily saw name tags on the cubbies. Emily, Nicole, Bitsy, and Anna. The girl playing with the ball shoved it into the one marked Nicole. I love to dance, said Emily. Not me, said Nicole. I like to play soccer. My mom made me take this class. I'd rather paint, said Bitsy. Anna shyly put her book away. In a month, we will have a recital, Miss Tingly Weezer said. We will be dancing a delightful song called Oh Little Bug. Bugs are icky, said Bitsy. I'm afraid of bugs, Anna mumbled. My little brother ate a bug once, Nicole shared. Emily was disappointed. She was hoping to be something wonderful like a princess, not a bug. And it looked like she wasn't going to be friends with Anna, Nicole, and Bitsy either. They had nothing in common. Miss Tingly Weezer had them make a circle and spin round and round. Bitsy got dizzy and bumped into Emily, who knocked into the cubbies. Their name tags fell onto the floor. Hey, said Emily, the first letters of our name spell bean. I hate beans, said Nicole. The next few classes were just as awful. After the fourth one, Emily got into the car with her mother. Our dance should be called No Good Bugs, Emily grumbled. She was very disappointed with her new dance class. Would a trip to Petunias cheer you up, her mother asked. Yippee, said Emily. Emily looked over all the candy. She finally decided on something special that she hoped would make the dance class better. The next day, Emily twirled and jumped while the other girls fumbled their steps. After class, Emily asked, Remember how our name spelled out Bean? Emily gave each girl a little bag. They opened them quickly. Jelly beans! I love jelly beans, said Bitsy. Me too, said Nicole. They're my favorite candy, said Anna, jumping up and down. 
Jelly beans are all different flavors, but they still go well together, said Emily. Maybe we could too. We could be the dancing jelly beans. Everyone liked that idea. But our dance is still about icky bugs, Bitsy complained. I bet we can figure out a way to make this recital really great, said Emily. Anna showed them books about bugs at the library. They found some bugs they actually thought were cute. Bitsy helped the girls design their costumes. Nicole taught them exercise she learned from soccer to get them in shape. Emily worked with the others on their dance steps. Finally, the big night arrived. Ladies and gentlemen, I proudly present the Jelly Beans, Miss Tingly Weezer announced. They will now perform Oh Little Bug. The Jelly Beans took their places on stage. Emily looked at the audience. She never seen so many people in one place. Miss Tingly Weezer began to play the piano. All of a sudden, Emily realized she didn't remember any of the steps. What's wrong? Nicole whispered. I'm scared, said Emily. Nicole took Emily's hand and started to do some silly soccer kicks. Then Anna and Bitsy started kicking too. Emily was having so much fun, she forgot to be scared and remembered her steps. The jelly beans did Oh Little Bug from the beginning to the end. They twirled and they skipped. They tiptoed and jumped, they danced and they pranced, and they boogie woogied. The crowd whistled and clapped. Hooray for the jelly beans! They cheered. The jelly beans bowed and went backstage to change. I almost messed up the recital, Emily said. But it was perfect, said Anna. Your kicks were great, said Nicole. I bet you'd be good at soccer. We could be the Jelly Bean Soccer All-Stars, Bitsy said. I just hope I don't forget when to kick, said Emily. Then they all went to Petunias for their favorite candy. Jelly Beans! Bean, B-E-A-N. Bitsy, Emily, Anna, and Nicole. What a wonderful story. It teaches us about friendship and teamwork and how we can succeed in both. We just need to try a little harder to work together. Thanks again to all my new friends, young and old, and a special shout out to my new subscribers, Levi, Ivani, James, Avery, Alexis, Mac, and Eileen. Please share, like, and subscribe to my channel for more fun and lovely stories, and leave a comment down below. Don't forget to look out for a next week's story with Miskina's bookshelves. Tell your friends. Goodbye.